and Grace has made Spirit Guide. Tonight, we're going to try an experiment and journey. I'm dreaming of an art world where art is used as a transformative tool. It isn't dogmatic, it isn't didactic, it isn't cliche, it's beautiful, it's inventive, it pushes, you know, both the body, the mind, the soul. For me, it's really important to think of art as a transformative medium. So, you know, I'm always thinking about the two brain hemispheres of uh, the left and the right, the rational, let's say, and the more creative. And so I always try to bring those aspects into my work. Uh, so when thinking about solutions or thinking about how to think creatively about today's world's problems. So, for example, in my performance practice, um, I work a lot around using shamanism and uh, meditation to think of new ways to look at things. To me, that's the beauty of art, you know, when you can have something very esoteric and very non-rational, let's say, and performative, and then it can become actually something practical. You know, art can have a wide range of uh, functions.